A note about some of the feet that you put on this machine. You notice that they have an eye up here. The 57D foot, for example, is a quarter inch foot with a guide, which is great for accurate piecing all the time. I usually use it in conjunction with a straight stitch throat plate. But if I'm not using that and setting it up my machine with that, watch what happens on screen when I put it on. Right now, I am set for a straight stitch center needle position, and it says 1C. Now, as soon as I put it on, I see a red light or indication come in near the foot. And that means that I am limited. It can tell that this foot is on and won't let me, for example, move needle positions past a certain point. You can move it, it just won't let you sew it. I'm gonna push that clear. But if I pick a zigzag, it will let me stitch up to a 1.1 millimeter wide zigzag. Well, because the foot is only has that one very small opening. So it limits me when I go to sew. So if you're picking a decorative stitch and wondering why you're not seeing that decorative stitch over here, what it's done, it's taken this stitch and narrowed it down to the maximum width that this foot can handle without breaking your needle. So some of these feet are smart, but you do wanna just double check. So anytime you see a red line, you can see that you have some limitations. So as soon as you take the right, that foot off, that will go away. And when you put your regular foot back on, you'll have the benefit of full stitch width to whatever settings you wanna sew.